Hey guys, I want to show you what to do with your disc. I know that many of my patients always want me to give you uh, just ideas of what to do uh, with the equipment we've given you. Uh, your wobble cushion disc, which is um, typically filled up, can be used as a cushion to stand on when you wear your head weights and um, you can uh, work on your posture with that. But this disc also is very good for proprioception uh, when you're wobbling on it. It's helping your spine and also your postural muscles, but also your legs. And actually, uh, one of the many things that you can do is you can do your workout training with the disc. And so here I'm going to demonstrate a simple little squat. Um, what uh, you can do is basically bring your knees together. And so you're going to try to do your best to keep your spine erect and then you're going to come down and you can hold on to something or if you have enough balance you can just go ahead and do what we call like a front squat and then come right back up and so here you're training your stability and you're also training your uh, core muscles your ankles your knees and your legs it's just doing about 10 of these uh, slowly up and down. You're training a lot of postural muscles, your core stability, again, your legs, all of this uh, to maximize your overall strength uh, of your legs as well, your glutes. And so um, once you do 10 of those, you can actually um, do a lunge. And so you can bring one leg forward, again, your knee back and then do a lunge down and up this way. Again, uh, focusing on keeping your knee behind your toes and then coming down in a lunge like this focuses on your leg strength, your glute strength, but also your ankle strength and your knee strength. So if you have problems with your knees, this is very good for all these kinds of areas, your joints, your proprioceptive, um, GTOs or mechanoreceptors in your muscles and your joints will help communicate to your body better. Again, like what you've seen me here, you can stabilize, or if you have more balance, you can just practice on doing it without um, holding on to anything. And so uh, doing that on both legs. So again, just some little things you can add to maximize your workout email me or text me or also you can put a message here if you have any questions again dr rosie may like us share this and we'll see you at the office bye, -bye.